<clears throat> Hello, it's 7.53 p.m. 11-2-2012. Now it's come to my attention that the banks are giving out money on God Pays accounts. But since I didn't tell how much, it's merely maybe a thousand dollars, I guess. The banks are now authorized for anybody that makes up to a hundred thousand dollars a year. One million dollars will be deposited into their account. And you can only open up one bank account. So don't go try and open up more than one bank account. People that make over a hundred thousand, they're earning blood money. So go back tomorrow. And you'll see that a million dollars has been deposited into your account. Would you like me to read a story? How an innocent boy became a thief. After reaching school one day, a boy realized that he did not have a pencil in his bag. In the bag of another child who was not present that day, he found a pencil, took it, used it, and unknowingly or un inadvertently put it in his own bag at the end of the day. When he went home, he saw the pencil and told his mother the story. She was happy with the thought that her son had a pencil because of the mother's positive reaction the child sensed encouragement at finding the pencil. The next day he purposely began to look at the bags of other students. He found some ink pots, books, and various other things. Again he took them home, showed them to his mother, and saw her pleased reaction. Some time passed. The boy grew up and he began to go into the houses of people and steal things. He had become a thief. As you might expect, th these, hap these happenings did not pass unnoticed. He was caught. Then he was forced to tell of all the thefts he had committed in the past. After being found guilty of all these sins, he was sentenced to death. He was then asked, do you, you have a last wish? If so, we will fulfill it. The boy replied, I would like to see my mother. As he had no father, he loved his mother all the more. His mother was called for. When she arrived, the boy embraced her and suddenly caught sight, caught sight of her ear and bit it off. The mother shrieked and shrieked while blood was pouring down the side of her head. The guards asked, What are you doing? You wanted to see your mother and look what you have done. The boy answered, The judges were really wrong. They have misjudged me. If anyone is at fault, it is her. When I was young and began to steal, she, could, she should have told me not to do it. She should have rebuked me and dealt with me accordingly. On the second day, then I would not have dared to repeat the same thing. My character would have been different than it is today. She was my teacher, responsible for these bad habits. Because of her, I suffer today. It was her negligence and her attitude that was not good for me. <clears throat>
Now since I'm supposed to be living off my own earnings, I opened up an account today, God Pays account. They rushed me over to a teller or to a bank manager, got my ID and found out that I was Fred Node. And they wouldn't give me any money because I'm supposed to be living off my own earnings. So they're supposed to tell you to vote for Fred, Reverend Frederick W. Node. So from now on, the man with the gold is the one who makes the rules. God bless you all. Amen. And Brittany, I'm waiting to hear from you. I joined your website today. Bye.